It's a new day for the metal casting industry. Thanks to the unique 3D sand printing capabilities using our binder jetting technology, we are revolutionizing the foundry industry around the world. Exactly how is this technology changing the industry? To answer that question, we took a visit to Shelbyville, Indiana, and a state-of-the-art facility recently opened by Kimura Foundry, marking its first entry into the international metal casting industry. Kimura designed this foundry with our S-Max technology as its main system to 3D print sand molds and cores, doing away with the need to use patterns to create tooling. In fact, Kimura has designed a complete A to Z system of production that includes design, 3D printing, cleaning and inspection, metal pours and finishing, all in one location. Company president, Dr. Yoya Fakuda, spoke with us about Kimura's operation and how the company evolved to embrace our technology. So Kimura Foundry, uh, we have a 91 years history in Japan. And uh, now our uh, management president is the fourth generation. We start to use uh, wooden pattern, then we change to formal process. We call the sign form pattern. In Japan six years ago, we when we started this uh, 3D printer business, uh, we discussed, we researched all the 3D printer in the world. We know several different uh, printer maker, but. Uh, after our research, we understand the X1 print is more uh, better and it has a very high technology, very good uh, the print quality. Making X1 binder jetting the core of their U.S. operations was just the beginning. Kimura created an all-in-one operation in Shelbyville, unlike anything we've seen. Let's take a quick tour of their A to Z production capabilities. We are foundry, make castings of our job. So uh, our uh, ad advantage is make casting. We have our engineer design. We design the casting, print some more. Finally, we all cast them and check them, uh, guarantee all the quality. So that's why I think we should build uh, every all the facility in one area, in one uh, location. That's why we will do everything here. Kimura created 25 new jobs in Shelbyville, including design engineers and foundry specialists. We spoke to Eric Johnson, the lead design engineer responsible for the S-Max production and quality. The X1 technology is very advanced and it gives us the surface finishes that we need to get the products out to our customers. With what we can print using the X1 printers, you can do undercuts and cores and stuff that you would not be able to create with the original or traditional foundry practices. There's a lot of detail that you can make that it would not be possible if it wasn't for the X1 printers. For Kimura, this is just the beginning. Overall, the company has a total of eight X1 machines, including an S15, S-Print, five S-Maxes, and an S-Max Plus, with plans for expansion, impacting the U.S. economy and foundry industry in a major way. Here you can see uh, we have more space at here. So in the future, we want to uh, install more 3D printer in this room and expand our building so we can uh, install more inspection uh, equipment, uh, expand our capacity. We have a very big dream. Uh, in 2027, it will become our 100 years uh, anniversary years. So uh, we want to get uh, successful in the United States and uh, support all of the uh, prototyping casting uh, made by 3D printer technology uh, in the world. 